finally, we got this done. Finally. Been waiting, 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 waiting. Adam, you did good. I appreciate that. It's really good to see uh, Casey and how she looks at you and how much she appreciates you and loves you. And we just, we're just so happy, Leslie and I are so happy that y'all two are finally together. The first time that I ever saw Adam was in high school. He was the new curly-headed kid from the big city out to Smithville. I moved to Smithville from Austin before uh, ninth grade. And I remember seeing Casey at church before I actually was in school. Two years later, we had a bunch of mutual friends and we were hanging out together, actually at my maid of honors. And um, I told her that I kind of liked him. And then another friend convinced me to text him one day and it kind of just went from there. Being the new kid in ninth grade, Adam Hahn was the talk of the town. And Casey was definitely talking about him. Casey, I can't believe today is finally here. It feels like we just started dating. It has been a fast 11 years. When we moved to Smithville, I near thought I would meet, I never thought I would meet the person I would spend the rest of my life with. Although Casey tried to keep her cool, we could all tell that she had a thing for him. I have watched what was once a little high school crush develop into an unbreakable relationship over the last 11 years. Through rivaling colleges and a long distance relationship, I have watched Casey and Adam build a beautiful foundation into what unconditional love truly looks like. Dear Adam, oh my gosh, it's finally here. 11 years in the making, <laughs> wow. Crazy how we used to say, I could see us getting married back in high school. Of all the people I asked to describe you, a few things always came up. One, that you're funny. Two, that you love food and to eat. And three, which I think is the most important, that you are loyal and honest to the people who matter most to you. This is important because it lifts those around you up, and that does not go unnoticed or unappreciated. Casey, I asked a few people who know you best to help with this portion of the speech, because who better to describe you and your relationship than those who hold you dear to their hearts? Casey is kind, funny, and easygoing. She's one of my most level-headed friends. She's always down for a good time and is someone who is easy to confide in because she is so trustworthy. She's determined, driven, but also can let loose and just chill. She and Adam are my favorite example of what a great relationship is. It's respectful, loving, and just makes sense. 
Casey, I can't wait to get married and probably like 15 minutes from now. Very anxious, everybody's excited for us and uh, all my friends love you and I'm excited to get this next chapter started. Hey Adam, <laughs> it's here. <laughs> um, I can't wait to get this day started and marry you and call you my husband. Adam, do you take Casey to be your lawfully wedded wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or poorer, in sickness and in health, to never dishonor or be betray her, but to love until death do you part? I do. Casey, do you take Adam to be your lawfully wedded husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poorer, in sickness and in health, to never dishonor or betray, but to love until death do you part. I do. <laughs> now, it is my pleasure, and with the power vested in me by the great state of Texas and the internet, I pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time, I'd like to introduce Mr. and Mrs. Adam and Casey Hahn. What the good Lord has joined together, let no man put asunder. When I was thinking to myself, like, what does Adam mean to me? It's reliability. And everyone that knows Adam knows he is incredibly reliable. He has been there for me over the last nine years, every time I've needed him. So I just want to say thank you, Adam, uh, and I'm always going to be there for you. This is the good life. Oh, 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 oh. This is the good life. Oh, 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 oh. Out in the sunshine, nothing but good times. This is the good life. This is the good life. But just as importantly has been Casey in this equation. So Casey had to give Adam the time and space to let our friendship grow. And I think that's why they have such an incredible relationship. They've managed to live such independent, strong lives, but then merged them together and compromised. And that's the hallmark of a good relationship. This 